Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Ohima. Welcome if you are a returning subscriber. Hey! So today we're going to be taking a look at the Fenty Beauty Ease Drop Blurring Skin Tint. Okay, I didn't even know they were coming out with this. I just went out to check and it was out by the door. So thank you Fenty for sending this out to me. Also, a lot of you have been asking about the new um, deepest shade in the bronzers. I did reach out to Fenty and they have that coming out to me. So as soon as it gets here, we're definitely going to be, going to be taking a look at we're gonna be taking a look at the added deepest shade in the Fenty Beauty um, bronzers, okay? So that's coming, bear with me once it gets here we're definitely going to be taking a look at it, okay? So if you wanna see what the new skin tint from Fenty is about and whether or not we can find a match because I generally don't have a match in the Fenty Beauty liquid foundations and hopefully I can find a match in this foundation, then keep on watching. <laughs> Okay guys, so there's a little booklet that came with the package. It says, look like you're doing the most while you're doing the least. So for those days, you want to look flawless effortlessly. So the new Fenty Beauty Easy Drop Blur and Skin Tint, um, it says the blur is real, light to medium coverage for all skin tones, blends and blurs to instant perfection and a few easy drops, no flashback, long wear, light as air, 25 flexible shades so the way that they actually set this new skin tint up is rihanna said that they were able to actually condense all their 50 shades into 25 shades so then so if you're someone who is in the deep category and you were between 420 and 498 which is where i fall try the shades 20 to 25. be sure to pair with hydra visor invisible moisturizer broad spectrum spf 30 sunscreen for the ultimate blurred finish that lasts so they sent over two of the easy drop foundations so fancy sent over the shades 24 and 25 also they're very fluid so definitely shake them before you use them okay so this is the shade 25 Ooh. 25 is deep and it's fluid you can see it like about to run down my face okay 25 might match better if not i can always mix the two i hate 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 mixing foundations but because i have both i might be able to mix it uh huh okay so between the two this is 25 and this is 24 if i had to pick one it would be 25 because i can lighten up with some concealer if i want to but you can see how fluid the actual skin tint is like it's running down my face right now <laughs> let's see because you just saw blending 24 into my forehead kind of sort of disappeared it uh, I'm sure it's because it's my forehead. Let's blend it in over here and see what happens. So we're definitely going to be going in with 24 just so we can see what it's all about. Okay, you guys. So because I have oily skin, I am not going to be not priming my face. I have to prime my face. And this sweatshirt keeps riding up. First, I'm going to go in with the e.l.f. Um, oil controlling moisturizer because it is oil free and definitely will keep my face looking matte a while next i'm gonna go in with my elf matte oil controlling matte primer this thing is so invisible i feel like on camera you can't tell that i'm putting anything on my face because of how it is mystery powder light-handed mystery powder if you have oily skin guys you have to to get ready for that day you know you don't want to get caught outside and your face is looking oily and your makeup is like nowhere to be found okay you don't want that especially if your makeup moves have you ever had makeup where you left the house and a few hours later it looked like you touched your face by accident and that makeup just moved off your face because your skin got oily and you didn't know 
I don't want that, okay? So definitely mattifying my skin. I'm finally on that powder before makeup kick, okay? So let me try it out and see how I like it. I am first going to try number five. Hopefully it comes out okay. Fingers crossed. I really, really hope it comes out okay. So this is a light to medium coverage um, product. So you can put as little as you want to get a light coverage or you can put as much as you want for a medium type coverage. I don't know what kind of coverage I want, but I, I'm just blending it in. I'm using a brush because I am very accident prone and with the way my shirt is situated, next thing I know, I stained my shirt and I don't want to do that. Okay, I, I don't want to stain the shirt. So <laughs> that's not gonna happen. Oh. I chose the right shade. This is the shade 24. I feel like it adjusted to the lighter parts of my face. It definitely blended in very, very, very well. Okay, let's try this side. Okay, let's go ahead and just apply it to the rest of our face. Now for like no makeup makeup looks or like for your, I don't want to put makeup on, but I want to have like good skin days. Do you do the whole concealer routine? Because for me, I feel like if I just wanted to have like a blurred kind of skin, I wouldn't want to do the whole, um, the whole routine. I'm happy that I went in with the with the mattifying products because it's kept my shine to a minimum. So I'm just gonna put a little bit of my JP number three. Okay, so this is what we have. I like the shade of it I feel like it's a little bright because of you can't see my neck with it but if you're able to see my neck with it it kind of balances out between my neck and my chest because you guys know the shades are different right Okay, let's go ahead and do the brows. I'm gonna be using the Fenty Beauty Brow MVP in the shade Deep Black. Go in with the Juvia's Place Eye Prep Eye Prime. This is the shade number three. This is the brown shade that comes in the collection. I'm only gonna put a little bit on because these things blend okay just like the concealers these things can go a long way okay so you only need a little bit it's a very light creamy 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 base and you just saw how quickly this blends and it blends in so nicely so like look how my eye looks right now i only use a little bit look how my eye looks over here So for the blush, I'm literally just using my blush brush on my face. I'm not putting any product on it. Okay, you guys, so this is our finished look using the new Fenty Beauty Easy 
drop blurring skin tints i like the way my skin looks my skin does not look like it's too much um i literally use like a drop of the concealer on my face very little setting powder i just put some of the foundation the powder foundation 4.95 as my um as my nose contour and you guys this is it like i like the way it looks i like the fact that even i mean even after i use all the mattifying products my glow is still coming through i'm not mad at it this is definitely something that you can throw on very very quickly and just put some setting powder on there and i think that will get you all squared away for um for like a quick run to the grocery store or like a quick errand i feel like if you try to do it the way that i did it might take you like 15 minutes to get ready but if you just do it like a quick simple rub down and just some setting powder and go if you don't need to do your brows it will be very very quick let me know down below in the comments if you're going to be trying out this fenty beauty easy drop blurring skin tint it's a light to medium coverage so you can get a lot of coverage out of it if you want or you can get as little coverage out of it as you want i am not mad at it i will definitely be using this again i feel like in the summertime if i go out a lot i'm going to have to mix the shade 25 and 24 so that i can get it to be a little bit deeper than shade 24 but it's not bad and i am not mad at it. i will put all the links to all the products that i use down below in the description box so you can check it out let me know down below in the comments if you thought about picking this up if you have picked it up and what shade you're going to be picking up thank you guys so much for watching i love you see you in another video bye